Ah, uh, oops. The timer ran out. I wasn't paying attention. Hi. I was admiring the emotes. I got carried away. I was, oops. <laughs> Hello. How's it going, everybody? Happy Wednesday. <clears throat> Sigh of relief. We're here. We made it. Holy chaotic. I'm feeling chaotic today. Actually, let's see how far. Why is that song so loud? The fuck? Hi. How's it going? Hi, Aries. I was just about to check my feral. 25. That's a fucking lie. <laughs> I want a retrial. Yeah, I'm so obsessed with all these little emotes. I want a candy corn sweater like the one I drew. Someone get it for me. Do they exist? Candy corn sweater. <gasps> There's one on Etsy. Oh no, they're so cute. I want this one. Where's this? This is a website I don't recognize. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> Acton is 77 and Aries is 32. Acton is leading the charge. Yeah, aren't they so cute? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so obsessed. Although I don't know why the on stream chat is not showing the Halloween emotes for some reason. And I don't know why. Uh, it's just a little slow. Chef is 12% feral. Also, I did hear you. Oh, Elden ringing. Fuck. <laughs> no! You're even less feral than I am. I was only a quarter feral. Chat, I found a candy corn sweater. Will I even get it in time? It's perfect. It's low stock. It's fifty dollars. Never mind. <laughs> and never mind. And never mind. <laughs> Must get for Halloween. Yeah, but not for fifty fucking bucks. Sticks his head in a freezer. Oh, you're hot. Fifty dollars, bro. I c no thanks. You're so talented, you could probably knit one or something. I do not know how to knit. <laughs> but thank you for your belief in me. Actually, funny enough, I was like, I could actually. Well, this one's 30 bucks. I, I could probably ask my sister to make one. But I just found another one that's 30 bucks. But it it says arrive soon. Get it by October 19th to the 30th. The fuck? That's such a large gap. I'll think about it. I will think about it. I have so many sweaters. I need more. I actually really need to go through my clothes and get rid of ones I literally never wear to get make room in my closet for more clothes I'll never wear. Crochet? I have no idea how to spell it. Crochet. Is it crochet or some shit? Wait, how do you spell crochet? How do you spell crochet? Crochet? Oh, yeah, it's crochet. Like this. Yeah, that's it. Crochet. I only know how to cross stitch. I tried learning how to knit at one point. But I could only knit hats, and then I never did it again. That's it. Hat, hats were fun, though. I'm not bl I'm blaming not knowing how to spell my allergies. Hey, it's totally fair because honestly, I didn't. I couldn't remember either. <laughs> yeah, allergies been bad, huh? My allergies have been bad too. Whoa, fifty five stream streak, damn girl. Thank you so much. That's so many. It's so weird. Every time I see y'all's numbers, I'm like, really? Have we done that many? <laughs> Have we ever really done that many? Ugh, I gotta chill. Dude, I hate this time of year for just like one reason. 
because I can never decide if I'm hot or cold. Like I'm cold, but I'm sweating. I'm hot, but I'm freezing. And there's like no in between. <clears throat> I almost choked on my spit. <laughs> I'm fine. And right now I'm like sweating, but I'm also cold. If you can knit a hat, you can knit a sweater. Yeah, you know what? I should just be, I'd be so cool and like just knit a bunch of sweaters for myself. I don't know if I should get tempted by that. That that might be a bad idea. I get hyper focused on things. It's getting dark so early uh, and it's getting light late. Like I used to wake up at six o'clock, 6.30 and start like the sun's coming up and I was like, hell yeah. Now I wake up right now, I'm waking up at seven because I've been going to bed. It's that time of year. Um, I've been waking up a little later and it's still dark. Yeah, and it's already getting dark right now. It's only 6.30, bro, I hate it. Oh, Elden Ring. Oh, Elden Ring, true, OG, true, true. Yeah, I hate when it gets, man, like, I don't mind, like, snow or anything like that. Like, I grew up with it. It's cool. It's whatever. I feel pretty cool to, to experience it. But, like, man, it's the fact that there's literally no fucking sun. And, like, it's so depressing. It's depresso. Espresso. <gasps> ah, Arachi, how are you doing? It's good to see you. It was pitch black by 6.40 tonight. Yeah, it's getting close for me. It's 8.40 for you. For me, it's 6.40. It's almost 6.40 for me right now. I hate it. I hate when it gets dark early because it makes me... I'm low energy, you know? We're approaching 24 hours of darkness here. Here? Where? Where is here? Holy shit. Dude. I can't imagine, because I get, like, mega, yeah, you in the Alaskan wilds, because I get, like, pretty depressed if there's, like, less sun. I get, um, what's it called? Winter blues or whatever. I get it pretty bad. Even when I, like, am, like, oh, I'll spend time outside or, like, when the sun is out, Like, I'll try to spend time in it, but it still doesn't help. Like, it's just... It's annoying. I hate it. If you drive five hours, you could get into Alaska. Oh, shit. Okay. You're in the Canadian wilds? Northern Canada. A Canadan! A Canadan? We got so many wonderful Canadian beans in this community. I love it. I love Canada. Are you in the Arctic? Northern Canada, basically. Can... can, can what? Kanakistanian. Whoa, that's a mouthful. <laughs> that's a mouthful of words. Kanakistanian. Wow. Completely made up, too. Yeah, that's it. It's pretty good, though, because it actually sounds legit. Like, how do you not know where that is? <laughs> Long short, story short, yes. You want to skip the maxing pin and keep your email pin instead? Um, no, let's do the back, the sack beat pin. Let's do a sack beat pin. This one was only supposed to stay up for like 20 minutes anyway. A little tired. Working away and all that, and then slaying monsters. How are y'all doing this fine Wednesday? My dudes. Well, dude, I'm doing great. Doing pretty good. I'm getting my... I'm just really excited that I'm getting my artistic flow back. My artsy flow. Because it was lost, but now it is found. I'm so proud of the emotes, and I even was... It's still kind of like hit or miss, because I worked on... I was drawing my dark elf and um it is looking pretty good. Um but I didn't 
I'm not like hyper fixated on it, but she does look cute. Why are dark elves literally the best? I love them. I noticed the discourse server icon changed too. Yippee! Yes, feral. The feral mummy. I'm Shasta spooky. I'm Shasta scary. Boo! I'm so scary. I'm terrifying. I'm so terrifying, chat. Rar. They're so cute and little. I know. They're so cute. I love them. I had so much fun. Like, what's nice about them, too? About, like, theming the emotes into, like, Halloween or Christmas or, like, literally anything? Is that, like, I already have the base emote. I just have to change. I just have to, like, basically change portions of it. And then it's done. And it doesn't take very long. Because I'm not building from the ground up. I've already got the base. It's great. And I love it. So yeah. I'm just pretty happy about it. I literally was like, okay, I'll just do a few. Yesterday, I was like, I'll just do a few. So I don't get, like, exhausted. And then after I did those three and I shared them in the Discord, I was like... But this one will look cute like this. And this one will look cute like this. And then I did the rest of them. And I was like, well, oops, there goes my whole morning. Whoopsie. <laughs> I do be like that. I do that. Oh, okay, jumped off the desk. I do that all the time. You know when you just like start and then you can't stop? That's me. My God, just a few. It's never just a few. It's like all of it oh chat i got my cats i'm stalling a little bit chewy was having a sale on their website that was like buy three get one free the fourth free it was like mitch mix and match of like treats and toys and brushes and all sorts of shit and there was this brush i really wanted to give my cats so i got them like a couple toys and i got them this is so dumb. <laughs> I got them catnip bubbles. I don't know how that's going to go. <laughs> but it's supposed to be here tomorrow. Like, it's fast as fuck. And I'm so excited because it sounds so dumb. But I'm also here for it. I don't know if we've ever had bubbles in this apartment since we got our cats. Or if we have, it's been a long time. I do love bubbles, though. Yeah, catnip bubbles. I'm, I'm genuinely curious what they're going to think of them. Because my cats are hit or miss. I will buy them something that I think they'll like, and then they hate it. Or I'll buy them something that I'm like, eh, they probably won't care about this much, and then they love it. Like, it's... My cats are weird. <laughs> my cats are weird. Like, weird in a good way. Like, I love them. But they're, God, they're strange. <laughs> they're so strange. My cats are strange. I like this music. Oh, no. My destiny is automatically updating. Fuck. I didn't open up my Steam today. I was very busy. We could put the old cat tree by my desk. But yeah, when we get a new one, I didn't buy a cat, the cat tree, though. I didn't buy the new one yet. Yeah, when we get a new one, we can definitely move the old one. It still works. <laughs> the new one I want, I was so salty. Wait, did I talk about this? I think I talked about this on Monday. Did I? Am I tripping? Am I losing it? Or was that yesterday? No, that was on Monday. I already talked about this. Yeah. But Cootherton bought it. Yeah. Kenny bought it. No, nah, I don't like, listen, I love my cats and I spoil the shit out of them and probably spend too much money on them. But no regrets for starters. 
But two hundred dropping like two hundred bucks on like a cat tree is like I could. I could do it. We bought it. We didn't. Oh, our old cat tree, this thing? Yeah, we did buy it together. I don't know what one you're talking about. It. Yeah, if Kenny bought the new one for some reason, I would be like, why? I was waiting for it to go on sale. How could you? <laughs> um, I'm waiting for the Destiny update to go through. Yeah. Chad, did you know that today on my on Facebook, I was on Facebook, Kenny and I have known each other for we've been Facebook friends for seven whole years. I was like, dang. Is it is on sale? Yeah, it is on sale for a single penny. Holy shit. Yeah. The cat tree I want is on sale for a single penny, zero percent off. I'm literally just waiting for it to go like 20% or even 10%. I'd be tempted. Like anything decent. But they're like, meh. Meh. I spent 120 on my dog's bed, but seeing him so cozy and it makes it worth it. Yeah. Oh, whoa, wait. It just actually went on sale for real. Oh, shit. Oh no. It's 30% off now. Oh, was that a mistake? <laughs> no, now it's 30% off. Now it's like a reasonable price. Now instead of 200 bucks, it's like 130 bucks. What the fuck? Guys, Oh no. Buy it. Looks like it's arriving tomorrow. Hold on, I wait. That's a steal. That is a steal. Because this thing is huge. This thing's like six, eh, it's like six foot tall and it's like wide. And it's got like multiple beds on the top, which is my complaint about this one. This one has one big bed on the top and then like a tiny little circle. And my cats are too big for the little circle. They grew out of it. This one has two huge square beds on the top. <sighs> Let me put it in my cart and I'll worry about it tomorrow. Shit, I didn't realize. But that's a damn good deal. Shit, are we talking about Mesmer again? No, Shaw, we're talking about cat trees. Does that sound like we're talking about Mesmer or? I mean, he is a steal. Is that what you mean? <laughs> How are you doing, by the way? Happy Wednesday, my friend. That's a damn good deal. Holy shit. Okay, I... Think about it tomorrow. Think about it tomorrow. Stop now. Stop. Stop. Stalling. Stop stalling. Let's open the game. <laughs> Six feet. Um, Mesmer is like seven feet tall or something. I don't know. I know Mulaney is like seven feet tall. She'd be so tall. <sighs> I always assume that. <laughs> If we talk about tall equals talk about Mismer, you're right. All right, chat, we're popping up the game here. Holy shit, I'm so excited that that is actually. So that was clearly like a website error. Or something, that original ad or per penny off the original penny off was a mistake Ugh, the tarnish is actually only three seven <laughs> actually now i'm curious wait i uh, now i want to wait stop everything hold on how tall is mesmer 
the impaler. <clears throat> the impaler is te that doesn't feel right. Oh, the they're talking about the life size mesmer. The impaler statue is ten feet tall. Some of the mods for cyberpunk are spicy. There's always porn mods. If mesmer, sh what the fuck? Reddit. Ugh. The general consensus is that six foot is low tall, six one is start of tall, and six two is definitely tall. What? Mesmer the Impaler is only 46 centimeters tall. Oh, so he is only like six feet tall, huh? He is shorter than Melania. But there is a 10 foot tall Mesmer statue. Someone on Reddit said if Mesmer's schlong is 18 inches, can we calculate? How tall he is in this shot. Nine feet. <laughs> Why are we assuming his pin is a dangerous level of large? That would send you to the hospital. <laughs> Actual spicy or a cringe fest? Well, some of them are, pro if it's anything like when I used to, when, like, I was modding, like, Skyrim or Baldur's Gate, some of it is spicy and some of it is cringe fest. And not Radon. Probably wouldn't even feel it. Oh, oh no. Dang. They just don't work together, huh? The outfits are spicy. Yeah, Kenny is playing female V in this playthrough. So he just finished playthrough. He's starting with a V. That's a girl. V with a vagina. And his outfit is her ass cheeks out. I was like, dang, that's... I messed up. I was like, dang, that's spicy. You know what's funny? I was- I oh, bitch! I was cracking up about- Kenny made his V and he was like, I made her after, like, another character. But it kind of looks- I told Kenny it kind of looked like me. Kenny has a type and it's me. She was like pale with freckles and brown eyes. <laughs> I feel so loved. Not the same hair, though. Ow, bitch! Stop fucking me up! Hey, you! Stop fucking me up. I don't like that. I'm gonna die to the first ad. What in the hell? <laughs> v with a V, yeah. Do you know how big your BP would have to be to actually use something like that? Your BP? Wait, what's a BP? Would it have to be to actually use something like that? Wait, blood pressure? Oh, 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 oh. I played it for Blindy. We're at the last act now. Oh. That's right. You're in the last act of Baldur's Gate 3. I made the blind one describe a person and I tried to create it and it was amusing. Oh, blood pressure. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Sorry, I don't ever know jargon. I play too many games and I get confused about any type of like what are they called and ac acronyms of any kind <laughs> bitch dude this place i'm clearly distracted 
talking about like V's and stuff. Uh. No, this was for Cyberpunk. Oh, 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 this was for Cyberpunk. Oh, cool. Okay. Oh. You also played uh, Cyberpunk too? Damn, you're a god of games. Yo. Like, being able to, like, help someone else play is, like, really cool. I think it's cool. You're not. Nah, I don't believe you. I don't believe you! You're good enough to help somebody else play, which is pretty freaking cool. Son of a bitch. Trying to describe the world in real time is more difficult than it sounds. I believe it. Hanya! Son of a bitch. I hate when these guys fall onto the ground because it's like so annoying because now I'm on fire. The saying a picture speaks a thousand words comes to mind. True. Yeah, you have to be good at describing. Are you... Are, are, the, oh, this is like really random. Are you like... How long have you been doing this for? I was going to say, are you like a writer? Like, are you like how... How has that been? Like, has that like made you better at describing things or like telling stories and stuff? I'm like genuinely curious because it seems so cool. Yikers. Stop it! Stop it now! How would you describe where you are right now in order to convey the story, your options, and try to give them the ability to interact with it? Oh, writer, I'm so far from that. It's hilarious. Uh, do not sell your shelf short. I'm sure you're great. Yeah, but you have to describe where they are and, like, enough to give them, like, help them make choices. Like, it's impressive. I'm on fire. What? That's not what I meant to do. It's like I don't even know how to play this fucking game, bro. Try it right now. Oh shit! I, I'm. I can try. Yeah, I'll try it. Here. Um. Oh shit! I don't know how. <laughs> um. Oh. You, uh. There is. Well. I guess it would also depend, too, because, like, did they lose their vision or, like, okay, am I imagining that they've never had vision? Because I know sometimes they lose their vision, so they have, like, some idea. Oh, shit. I'm already <laughs> freaking out. I don't know how. There's lava. How would you describe lava? hot and sad and everything wants to hurt me oh yeah that's really hard ah oh it's a scene Yes, 
I'm a cicada again, finally. Bao 我是父王的亲生骨肉这是你的家事天命天命连上这罗刹宝地我听闻剩余几个遗物我从来都只在意你一个人我从来不如我们两个一起走吧我 与我细说，母亲不可信他。这次面露奸相，定有倾国之意。行贼，我是白瞎了，请你救人。你竟趁人之危，你你敢？长辈们说话，轮不到一个庶女弄蛇。我与你母亲相识的时候，你那父王大约
I'm gonna woo Kong. Oh shit! Brazen adulterer. Oh, let's kick his ass. Okay, I guess we're gonna fight fight him now. Keeper of flaming mountains. <laughs> what the heck is going on? <laughs> I wasn't ready for this. Whoa! Oh, this is neat. Yeah. Whoa! 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 He had to wait until he banished the fox girl to oblivion? Probably so he could protect her. Probably. Uh-oh. Ah, yeah, yeah. Well. <laughs> Bashi is so... Thank you for healing me. What? Whoa! What the hecking heck is going on? Ah! Hiya! Ay -ay -ay! Well, this is crazy. What is happening? Do I have to kill them all or. Archers! I hate archers! I have to kill you all. <laughs> I've got your rake and you've got me. I think that might be my favorite Bashi quote. Get your ass down here, you nerd. Oh, here there he is. Is it? This can't be like the only phase, right? Take him on yourself. Uh, I'm working on it. You're definitely going to have to beat him again solo. Yeah. No way. This is it, right? Maybe it is because he's summoning other enemies. Oh, no, it's not. My horse, friend! Uh-oh. <laughs> 
He's about to get eaten by a fish. Minus one Bashi. Oh, oh man. I fought you, but when you were Bashi. This arena is so interesting because it's like black and white. Ow. I don't know if I'm gonna actually be able to I'm not gonna be able to beat him. There's no way I have no more mana Yikes yikes <laughs> Yikes, okay I was not expecting that is what I was walking into. But anyway, sorry. We were. I'm going back to your earlier comment, Chef. You said you have to make decisions on what info to convey and how to be scripted but not confusing. Yeah. We rely so heavily on vision. Like, how do you describe stuff that someone maybe hasn't ever seen before? Like, that's my brain. That hurts my brain a little bit. Uh, okay, here, let me switch to cloud step because I don't think I'm gonna need a rock solid yeah interesting oh yeah I also wanted to do this one I learned how this one works by talking to Kenny and do I have any sparks? See how much shit? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I walked right into that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Anyway. Well, shit. I'm probably gonna have to do that all over again. In the beginning. Whoa. Whoa. It's so bright, dude. <laughs> hey. Oh, why is she? I hurt. Ah, yeah, yeah. Don't, don't stop. What what kind of meter is this, by the way? What is he doing to me?
We gotta kill the archers first. Archers suck. And they gotta go. Kill them all. Kill them all. Dude, that is so good. It's different because you've never had someone just watch me play a game before. True. decisions in the game and then making those decisions work. Yeah, it's it's Oh no, what are you doing? Oh, he was able to do like a grab attack because the meter went up. Get your ass down here. is this Ay! Oh, I don't get a choice okay oh yikes That's not what I meant to do. I forgot how it works. I... <sighs> Yikes. You try to kick me! Thanks, Bashi. I embarrassed myself. I accidentally detransformed because I panicked. Ay, ay, ay! Okay. Whatever. Ah. Why'd you heal me more? <laughs> it's such a dumb thing to say. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. That was- this was a terrible try, by the way. I'll say this. This chapter so far has been full of, like, really interesting choices. Yeah. Yikes. Why are you screaming? Holy shit.
want sushi now? Honestly, I always want sushi. I'm so dead. Shit. Uh, I played Witcher with her, but since some of the dialogue options are timed, it led to some hilarity. I <laughs> I have to read the options. I have to read the dialogue and the options, and then she has to decide, and I have to tap in her decision. Oh, I bet that. <laughs> I bet when you're like trying to tell her everything and it's timed, oh my God, I can't even imagine being like, oh, by the way, you have like two seconds to decide. And she's like, ah. <laughs> I hate this form. This fight, Jay? This fight is interesting. I... Uh, it is... A fight. Dude, he's got a lot of health. That's kind of why I'm doing a struggle. Can I, like, run around the outside? Yeah, I want this. A long bomb. Bomb? Also, since we're not in lava, let me put this on. Um, and what is that as a drink? Considerably increases damage executed by the next attack. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Visually, it's a very pretty fight. Yeah, it's really pretty, but like, it's like... The, well, the fish is, like, running around and, like... Going all over the place. <laughs> There's just a lot of health here. Because we have to fight a bunch of... We have to fight him, and we have to fight a bunch of ads, and then we have to fight the fish. Like, <laughs> I love the yin and yang thing now happening. Ay, ay, ay. Oh. Hmm. Ay, ay, ay. Interesting. I think the meter. I'm gonna test something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoa, that's a new move. This guy is cool, though. Yeah, yeah. I meant to dodge earlier. Yeah, am I? Hmm. Maybe not. I don't know. Like these, my yeah, yeah. Ooh, can I do this? It does. Okay, see, there's like a meter, and if I touch like the balls that he puts in the court or whatever in the arena, then it actually makes the meter go down. Oh, weird. Ah, yeah. 
touching balls again? Yeah. Are we really excited? Excited? Are, are we really surprised? Excited. So if I step in the black side now, the meter will go down? Yeah? Maybe? Oh, I can't tell. So there's like a meter happening here. I'm about to get the meter full. He's gonna grab me. Oh, the meter went down. Yeah, the meter is going like up and down. Interesting. So now there's white balls. So if the black meter fills up, then I'm in danger, but I can grab this. Oh, oh interesting. Ay, ay, ay. Ah. Did he just say that we're no match for him? Oh, minus one, I guess. I wonder why he's using this as a summon. Ah, yeah. Oh, yikes. I need to heal, first things first. Fuck! Oh well, that works. I was able to hit him in the town. Aw, oh, minus one. to do here like what what do you do <laughs> what whatever i'll figure it out don't worry about it there's just me asking questions out loud you can ignore me though I deserve that.
I don't know what to do here. I did it. Ooh, I... Mmm. I am so hot. I am so, so good at video games. Ow. Let's go! Ooh, that was great. Loser. <laughs> I killed your fish. What? Did he say that Wu Kong is the one who ruined him? Am I not Wu Kong? What? How many Wu Kongs are there? Whatever. I wonder if there's a mechanic involving the change in color if it's just a visual thing. I think some of it was a little bit of um mechanic, like the balls. Like, that he was, like, summoning were different colors. <laughs> a lull. And, um... It seemed like if my meter was going, like... Because the meter I had, right? It was, like, in black and white. And if the meter was going into, like, the black too far, it seemed like if I touched any of the white balls, then it would go down or up or something. I don't know. It was weird. The fish was changing color, too. Yeah, it seemed like when the fish was black it was more aggressive and on the ground and when it was white it was flying around i don't really know but it doesn't matter because i won <laughs> if, if there was a mechanic it's over oh wait i want to see what this um this when ha 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 hello when health is above half the decent one is in a yang state which moderately reduces damage taken but disables critical hits. When health is below, the Destin one shifts into Yin, which massively increases crit chance, but massively increases damage taken. Don't get tempted by this one. Don't get tempted by this. Don't get tempted by that. It is not worth your life. You know, it's funny, if I wanted to, I could have just gone past and continued forward. Like, I didn't actually have to fight him. I should probably rest, though. It was a really cool, um... area. Or, like, the- yeah, like, it was, like, really cool. So he used to be friends with- oh no. Another cart. Fuck. So he used to be, like, friends with Wukong, but then something happened? Bitch. <laughs> you also got hit. That's funny. I actually don't have any um, health. 
Did I get any key items from, let me look at this really quick. Also, can we just talk about how this needle is like so broken? <laughs> it does a lot of damage, like considering you just like pull it out of your ear hole and let it go. It's pretty freaking good. It's kind of crazy. No, I haven't gotten anything new. Okay. Here it is. Do I dare? I might die here. Crimson silver cart. Are you gonna eat me? Ow. No, but you're gonna smack me. Ah. Hi, he shit on me! You shit on me. Yikes, holy shit, this guy, I'm dead. I'm so dead! I'm on fire, I'm on fire? I forgot I'm on fire. He must have had Taco Bell, true. <laughs> okay, well, hey, you know what I could use in this, on these fights too? I can use the fire mental if I wanted to, because it makes me immune to fire. Actually, maybe I'll put that on right now. Um, also, I wanna go back to, uh, Rock being rock solid, please. Umbral Abyss? Or Frost? Wait, which one is it? Ebb and Flow. There it is. I wish it would just say the name of who they were, because the name of the spell... hurts my brain. Oh yeah, and then I was gonna put this on. Because I can use this mantle to fight that guy like easy peasy. It's like easy mode. Well, not really, but it's easy mode. An interesting. I will say this about the fights that have been in this chapter so far. They're all very unique. And I don't say that in a bad way because, like, I don't. We really did just like get something very unique in this chapter. We've had like very interesting like types of fights I've never really seen before. I don't even know. Bitch. Yeah, it's, it's unique, it's different. Cause I really liked that fight with like the two heads and then like there was all there's two duo fights in this one already that I just like Oops. Ah yeah yeah. Like wait, let me put the mantle on. Oh, it's not ready to use. I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. I can't see. Yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah.
Yeah, I am immune. I'm not getting hurt by it. It's funny. No, 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 don't be on his ass. Oh, I miss. That's great. Ouch. Yeah, hit me. It hit me. I can't, I, I'm stuck in the corner. I can't see shit, bro. I'm so dead. Ow. Jesus. Bro, he was chunky. So there are five carts and we've seen four of them. One of them ate our horse friend. So we gotta get something that'll open it back up. I don't even know. Nice try, buddy. Oh, it's these guys again. So we're looking for this fancy fan. I wonder what happened to the lady that Bashi was disguised at. Like the mom. What happened to her? Is she... Where is she? Ooh. We can rest here. Good. Two percent. Dang. That's low calmness. We are varying degrees of feral this day. I stretch. It throws a brick at bot. You're talking about plantain fan? Mm, yes, that's what we're looking for. Oh, is this a boss? -a? This looks like a boss. -a. That looks like a fancy boss. Oh yeah, this is certainly a boss. Nine cap lingzi guai. Hey now. Oh, what the heck? <gasps> what? What the heck? What did you do to me? You bitch! He's my. Oh no! What is this? 
Let me do it. <laughs> oh, uh, crazy. Let him hit you. Okay, I see. It's an AoE. <sighs> oh, he, it's like he's taking his head off. It's so cute. I'm, I'm so screwed. Oh no, I got it. Okay. Nice. Oh, that was so cool. Headgear? Oh, I got a piece of headgear? That was so cool. Let me look at this headgear. I want to see what it looks like on her. <laughs> Slowly loses health, but massively increase health recovery when using the gourd. What? Why would you? In what? Why would you want to use this? I mean, look at how pretty it is. It's actually kind of cute, but like what? It You lose health, but when you drink, you get a lot of extra health. You're still 12%. Damn, chef. That's wild. <laughs> Dang. Um, you th the bot doesn't lie apparently. Damn. Oh, meditation spot. That's yeah, a guy. That's a bull. We were so far from him. I thought. Oh, pretty. Oh, should we read some lore? Oh, he's got a wound. He is wounded. Oh, yikers. He's very wounded. Can I, like, traverse this or no? Okay, I was curious. I did not realize we were so close. The poor bull, yeah. Oh, yikes. Oh, no, no, now I'm sad. Okay, hold up. This is important. We fought... Okay, we have... I I'm curious about character here. Praying Immortal. That's okay. Keeper of Flaming Mountains. I was like, holy story. I really want to know this story. I'm really curious about this one. Because he... W Wukong got mentioned? Or, yeah, Wukong got mentioned? The furnace crumbles, bricks fall, a day of disgrace. Lamented he the beauty he could not embrace. All his talents wasted on the golden sun. Looking back, he's become a foolish one. The galaxy was clear and the sky was spotless. That night, a young Taoist boy sat at the furnace, fanning the fire. Feeling drowsy, he was about to sneak in a nap when he suddenly heard a soft laugh. Looking up, he saw his master standing at the door with a girl, watching him doze off. He quickly straightened his clothes and stood up to apologize. Contrary to his usual stern demeanor, the master did not scold him. Instead, he called the boy over and briefly introduced the newcomer, instructing them to guard the furnace together from now on. Finally, he said lightly, She is your senior. You may call her Raksha. Raksha. Wow. Okay, I can't talk tonight. Raksha. See. That's a mouthful. 
At first, the young Taoist boy was delighted to have a companion, but upon hearing that the newcomer was a senior, he felt displeased. As soon as Master left, he decided to make things difficult for her. Handing her the fan, he said, the furnace is now your responsibility. It's only a right that the older one does the work, isn't it, my senior? The girl did not argue and simply smiled. Indeed, my junior, you may go rest. The next day, the master ascended the, when the master ascended the altar, the girl approached. The young Taoist boy thought she was going to complain, but instead she said, Master, as a new disciple, it is only right that I fan the fire. However, the fan my junior gave me is a bit small and not very handy. Master glanced at the young Taoist boy and smiled. If that's the case, I'll make a new one for you. You, might as well, you may as well wield it. You may as well wield it as a nice vessel. The young Taoist boy had not expected his usual strict, usually strict manner, master to be so kind to the girl. Gradually, he began to see her in a new light. From then on, they practiced together. He discovered that the girl was adept in both Buddhist and Taoist teachings. No matter what scripture the master taught, she could always engage in discussion, whereas he often struggled to keep up both in speech and thought. Later, when the furnace was kicked over, he was severely punished by the master. While other disciples looked on coldly, it was only his senior who volunteered to descend to the mortal realm to help him. In the mortal realm, he learned that a senior had her own cave dwelling and a group of loyal followers. The master had even granted her the title of earthly immortal as compensation. Sometime later, the master arranged for her to marry a Yagwai king in the mortal realm. Though he felt a bit melancholic, he understood that he was ultimately unworthy of her, no matter how many dirty tasks he had done for the master. In the master's eyes, he would never be a match for her. Aww. Aww. Mm, and then we uh huh yin yang fish this is the fish so the fish and the guy got both little things it's cute Black yin fish, white yang fish, stirring storms with sky flipping swish, leaping twirling, never at rest, boundless power in a bowl compressed. In the South Sea, there is a fish over six meters long. Its dorsal fins resemble a blade and can change color at will. Whether black or white, this fish can fly into the sky, creating massive winds and waves as tall as mountains. Each time this fish appears, the, villages, the village suffers from a plague. Once, a fisherman return, returning from his catch countered an elderly man who could barely walk. Despite his frailty, the old man carried a heavy, tattered bundle filled with scrolls. Exhausted and without money to pay for a boat ride, he struggled along the riverbank. The kind-hearted fisherman, seeing the old man's plight, offered him a free ride across the river and even gave him two fresh fish for a meal. Grateful, the old man performed a divination on the spot and said, in a few days, a young man wearing a bamboo hat and white rope will pass by. Under no circumstances should you let him come to your village. On the day he arrives, do not conduct any business on the river, or you will lose your life. After delivering these cryptic words, the old man vanished from the boat, leaving the fishermen both astonished and frightened. Yet, he etched the old man's warning deep into his heart. A few days later, while fishing, he indeed saw a man on the riverbank who matched the old man's description exactly. Man, claiming to be weary from his travel, travels, asked the fisherman if he could take him to the nearby fishing village to rest. The fisherman initially wanted to refuse, but then decided to take the man to the neighboring village downstream instead. After dropping the man off, the fisherman docked his boat and dared not return to the river. At that moment, the man pulled a black bull from his sleeve and threw it into the river. As soon as the bull hit the water, a massive pitch black fish emerged, and a fierce storm erupted, with waves surging sky high. The fisherman fled without looking back. Sometime later, he heard that a severe plague had struck the neighboring village, killing many people. Initially feeling a sense of relief, he soon, soon learned that refugees from the neighboring village had brought the plague to his own village, and they too were not spared. Yikes. Yikes. There was no story for that weird, um, holy shit. For the bo other boss I just fought. Unless it's considered a lesser Yaogwai. Meow. No, it's not interesting. Okay. Alright. 
Uh, where am I? I'm already turned around. Making my way. I, I hope I'm going the right way. I think I am. Haha. <laughs> I'm so directionally challenged. It's actually hilarious. I'm impressed by myself. Oh, yeah, we're making our way around. <laughs> I see. That one shot me, chat. That's not good. Scared me. I thought that rock was gonna save me, but it didn't. New emo idea. You looking at an upside down map with a question mark above your head? It's actually a great idea. <laughs> like, huh? Question mark? Hi! He broke out of that way faster than I was expecting. What? Make it upside down. The north arrow is at the bottom, pointing down. That's actually perfect. We're, that's a great idea. Oh, shit. Chad, I don't know what to do. Can I just dodge through? Oh, I'm bald. I didn't realize there was a little thing on the side here. So stressful. Run! I got stuck on an invisible wall. Oh, and it's another one of these. Get him, boys. Chase the ball. Oh. <laughs> that was silly of them. Yikes, this part is really scary because, like, if you fuck up. 
You have to go like really far. Okay. Okay. I'm not panicking. My God, bro. <gasps> I'm so screwed. It's <gasps> <gasps> so stressful. What? She found it. Mutinadi是左右为难,才逆了行踪 Oh, you do it? Oh shit, Baji's about to be dope as fuck. second there's something over here no okay just want to double check holy shit bro that was crazy <laughs> oh no he's so dead bro rip minus one bashi and he's dead everyone oops it's so over oh no Oh, I feel so bad for him. He looks pretty rough. Imagine the iron ball just like reappears and just like kills me right now. You're going to win this boss fight for him. I mean, I will win every boss fight. No problem. Dang, why does this sh hold up? Okay. <sighs> Rest so we have our magic.
小心，父亲，天明人我带来了。趁着哥哥不在，父亲可把那东西交还于他。此物一旦物归原主，哥哥自然死心，火焰山的劫数也便解了。好个泼猢狲！咱们作死，都死不干净。可惜，来的不是时候。父亲糊涂了吗？小女把天命人带来救你了。是糊涂了，可眼没糊涂。你不是。<咳>父亲此话从何说起？平平吃尽千辛万苦，寻了人灭了火，不就是为了回到父亲这里？早知把眼也戳瞎好。Thank you for the fallen. 要 plot twist? What? <笑> oh, 莫急啊，老畜生，一会儿就碎了你一地。哎呦 ，See, I knew something wasn't right, but I like wasn't sure. 帮我卖弄这一把手段。Red boy, it is the red boy. 真没意思，不如都杀了利索。我打扮做那小妖精，自刎一般无二。你是怎么看穿的？他不像你，面上敬我，心里一点儿不惧。哎呀，哎。He's scary. 少不得要再把那小贱人抓回来，好好耍子一番。不过，眼下先把你们两个好兄弟烧成灰，葬在一起。闲情雅致。Oh shit! 时候多的是。Why though? What is your problem? What is your problem? His Samadhi fighter is very dangerous. Yeah. Oh yikes! Yeah, oh, oh! I didn't notice he was hitting me. <laughs> My bad. I was just like, huh? Why am I getting hit? <laughs> I'm extremely intelligent. Damn, his design is cool. <sighs> huh? Wait, hold up a second. Is this like... Okay. There's, there's like something... There's something else in here happening here. So he's betrayed his dad and decided to kill him. Oh, minus that then. Yikes! Oh my god! Bro, I got stuck. I got stuck on the rock. Don't look at me. All right, I got knocked out of my first spell, and then I, and then I got stuck on the rock. Uh, that one doesn't count. I do have the fire mantle on, although that does make my crit go down.
Let's go. Fighting a little boy? But he's not a little boy, he's 300 years old because he's a god. Dude, he was in the fire! The fire! The fire! The fire! The fire! <laughs> he was in the story about, like, he liked back. Black bear, why? Okay, I deserve that. Please be one face, question mark? Yeah. I, you know, you're right. It's true. It's so true. Yeah. Okay. Oh, what? Why? Oh, 
者，所以我不敢吃，他来要我更不敢给。